up where he went. You want cream? It's how I take it. Maybe you wanted to try something different. Directions? What? Uh, directions. Um, yeah, sure. Where do you need to go? No, you just look like you. Didn't oh no, know no, where you... I'm good. I'm good. Thank you. Okay. Uh, just so you know, Vanderbilt, Flatbush. Thank you. Hey, Ethan, it's me. I'm just calling to let you know that I'm stuck at work, and I'm uh. I'm gonna be late tonight, so um, talk to you later. Bye. Are you following me? Guess I am following you. You must be Amber. Oh, you're... Logan Pierce. Yes. Realtor and local direction giver at your service. Well, it's nice to meet you again. You too, right this way. But if you are looking for something bigger, I have another place that I think your husband and you would love. Oh, no. No, it's, it's just gonna be me and my daughter. Sorry about that, I just saw the wedding band. You know what? I love it. I'll take it. Cool. Okay. Great. Let's uh, set up an appointment. We can get all the paperwork done. Perfect. Hi. Ethan? I uh, don't oh know. She's uh, taking a nap. I need to talk to you. Okay. It's important. Ethan, I'm leaving you.
What? I'm sorry. Stop. Don't, uh, take another step towards me. We should talk about this. The logistics. Emily. Do not. Do not take another step. I'll be out by the end of the month. These things happen, Gracie. They happen all the time. It'll be okay. Okay? For the better, I think. Well, in time, yes. You got all your boxes, Mommy? I got all my boxes, and I'm gonna take them to my new house, which is gonna be our new house, like we talked about. With Daddy. No. No, not with Daddy. Daddy's gonna stay in our old house. You're gonna have two homes now. You're gonna have Daddy's home and Mommy's home. I don't want two homes. I know. I'm sad about it, too. It's okay to have sad feelings about it. I don't want you to go. I'm gonna miss you so much, baby girl. But when you're not with daddy, you're gonna be with me. Four whole days a week. Like a sleepover? <laughs> the best sleepovers ever. I love you, mommy. I love you too. I'm gonna go now, okay? Here we go. See you in a few days. What do you say you come with Grandpa? We'll go fix us up some lunch. Hmm? We'll go over there and you can help me. Come on. Oops. I'm gonna call you tomorrow. <laughs> Good morning, Amber. Hey, Soul. Good to see you. How was your weekend? Yes. Pretty uneventful. Right. I was told I could find Amber Evans here. I'm Amber, yeah, how Hi. can I help you? I am presenting you with a summons with a notice of divorce. It's very kind of you. Would you please sign here? That was quick. Sorry. Divorce? Yeah. Can we not talk about it right now? Of course. Hey. Come and find me when you are ready.
Can I get you anything else? No, thank you. Hey. Hey! <laughs> what are you doing here? Aside from buying a stash of wine, no, I... No, no, I mean, I mean, in this neighborhood. Oh, uh, well, I live up the street. Really? Well, yeah, for now. So, are you, you settling in okay? It's... Slowly, yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, it was really great running into you. Yeah, yeah, really great. Is that everything? Yes, thank you. I'd actually like to buy you a housewarming gift. Oh, no. No, 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 you don't have oh. to do that. Oh, I just did. Thank you. You're welcome. But it, it wouldn't be much of a housewarming without people. I suppose not. You think you can make it? Sure. When by that I meant tonight, like now. Oh. Well, I gotta check my schedule. Great. Looks like I'm free. <laughs> Great. Hi. Hi. She asleep? Yeah, she can keep her eyes open. Thank you. Thank you. All right, bye. Bye. Um, I'm just gonna be one second. Okay. Love you. 
sorry that it's so dark. My ceiling lights are still out. Oh, you know, I can call the guy for you. Oh, no, 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 that's not. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, I love what you've done with the place. Thanks, yeah. I've got some, you know, you're messing with me. No, I love it. The boxes add this, like, je ne sais quoi, DIY chic. <laughs> Work in progress, right? Like me. Like everyone. So, what do you like to do? For fun. Uh, what do you love? Um, I um, don't feel like I've ever really, you know, I, I went from being a kid to having a kid, and then I, out of my parents' house, into Ethan's house, I'm a mom, I work, you know, I just, I don't really feel like I even know the answer to that. That's okay. It's kind of exciting, you know? Because now you get to figure it out. Here's to figuring it out. Look, you know, I don't really know you. And I don't, I don't know what happened, but it sounds like it's something that you really needed to do. And uh, not everybody does that. I think it's brave. Brave. So what about you? I mean, you're... You're a, you're a realtor, you live temporarily in this neighborhood, and, you know. Well, I, uh, I don't have to just talk about it. I can show you. If you're free on Thursday night, you can meet me here. I can do Thursday. Cool. Cool. No, uh, Logan told me to stop by. Oh, are you Amber Evans? Yeah, yeah, she has a table set aside for you right there. Okay, yeah, thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Taking requests. Travelers, yeah. amazing day. Uh, um, you know what? Never mind. I got it. I know what I want to do. Uh, it's an old song, but it'll be new to you, and it's one of my favorites. And it's called "Hold On." See down the road I'm traveling But I'm not alone The 
love is calling over the rolling hills and I'm running to get to you as we're standing face to face I long to hear Sit down the road I'm traveling, but I'm not alone. <laughs> Thank you. Looks like romance if I ever saw it. What? No, I am just chatting with a friend. Mm -hmm. How many years have I known you? Hmm. A friend. <laughs> <laughs> I told you. Good. I know, right? Can't come down here and I'll try it. What are you writing? Not writing. Hmm. Sure looks like you're writing now. Not writing. Can I use that actually? So good. You're an artist. In a former life, maybe. Can I keep it? All yours. This gives me an idea. Walk with me. Well, this is my ride. Why don't you hop on in? She's feeling my heart. I like to coordinate it. Don't touch the car. I love making everything I do shine. I can feel it pulsing through me. Now I know. Beautiful. Such a good day. Yeah. You're awesome. I like you. Me too. I should probably get going. Okay. This is fun. Yeah.
at all. Hey, Amber, I was gonna... I can come back. I'll come back. You... No, I... I... And so I ended up in this hostile kitchen. <laughs> no, you didn't. I did. <laughs> I love this song. Mm. Oh, yeah, this is a good one. You know this song? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sing to me. Break me out. <laughs> Make it be well. Well, I want to dance. Just a little bit. I feel the spirit. Oh my God, look at you go. Touch me, feel my desire. <laughs> Wait, I need to see this robot. <laughs> I can't see this. Wait. We're dancing at a bar. Like a bunch of hooligans. When I was a little girl, my mom and I used to come to the beach and take these long walks to find rocks or stones. And then we would assign some sort of meaning to it, an emotion or something, like anger or sadness. And then we would throw it into the ocean. It was this way of releasing things we didn't want. I like that. Did you ever do it for things that you didn't want? Yes, occasionally we would <laughs> make a wish. But, you know, it was really special because my mom was just so practical in so many ways. So whenever we did that, it was... It felt like something really magical might happen. I didn't really have anything magical like that growing up. I do have this disappearing mom, though. And this really cool key I wear around my neck. If I use it, I open my front door. <laughs> Magic rocks sound a lot nicer. Yeah. I could have used some of those when I was a kid. Hello.
Hello. How you doing? Good. Yeah? There was a guy on the subway and he said chip and daddy told me never to say that. Right. Well, daddy's right. <laughs> So we're gonna go to the park, and then I'm gonna make you your favorite. Pizza? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Hi. 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 So this is my friend Logan, and uh, she's gonna hang out with us today. Miss Emily, it is my pleasure to make your acquaintance. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited to go to the park, are you? Do you like slides? Because I love slides. You yeah. like slides, you don't, never mind. I don't love slides at all. They are. They're terrible. Uh, who is this? This is uh, my friend Logan. Logan, this is Ethan. Ethan, hey. Logan, pleasure's all mine. Nice to meet you. Shall we? Swings? What's that? Dessert. Ooh. Yeah. Oh. Your job is to taste. Okay. Close your eyes. Mmm. Open. No, don't cheat. Well, I'm not cheating, it was reflex. I mean, open what? Eyes okay. right now. Shh. We're okay. gonna wake up everyone. Sorry. God. I forgive you. Okay. Hang on. What's all this? It's happening. Cheat proof. Uh huh. Ready? Mm hmm. Okay. I see. Is that okay? Mm-hmm. Ready? Okay. Open. Open wider and <laughs> bind. Mmm. It's like a chocolate brandy. Do I, do I win? Do I get a prize? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. Mm. Okay. You That's ready good. for the next one? Mm, can I say no? Not really. Oh. <laughs> okay. All right. Hang on. It's falling. Mm. You ready? Mm-hmm. Mm. We shouldn't do this. Wait, what? <sighs> Why not? <sighs> it's just it's, it's so confusing because I have all these feelings for you. But I really value our friendship. And I'm like kind of attracted to you. Like really attracted to you. <laughs> and I don't know what to do with that. So maybe it's better left untouched. Okay. Slow down. <laughs> what I'm hearing is you like me, you want me.
And then there was this part about not touching, but <laughs> I think we could just strike that from the record. I do like you. A lot. I'm just overwhelmed by this feeling that I want to get closer to you. Closer. I like that. Can we just take it slow? Of course. You know, I'm really concerned about this bill. This contractor doesn't come through. I we got gonna... it. You got it. I got it. Okay, while you got that, why don't you tell me who's the mystery texter? <laughs> what? The flirtatious smiley texts. <laughs> flirtatious smiley texts. Oh, oh, come on. Who's the lucky guy? There is no guy. Okay, fine, if you insist. See? <laughs> okay, you got me. But only slightly. Oh, come on, details. Come on, boss. Oh, how convenient. I'm your boss when you don't want to spill. I'm happy for you. Who is it? Not this time. Okay, I have my reasons. Hey, I was just talking about you. Oh. That's just selfish. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's the G train. Mom? Excuse me? You're in New York? I think you've mistaken me with someone else. Mistaken me with someone else? Wow, you're incredible. I don't know what you're talking about. You're right. You wouldn't. You never did. You're right. This is us. Stranger. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Stop, stop, stop. You're gonna hurt yourself. Okay, stop, stop. Look at me. Look at me. You do exist. Okay? You matter. And if she doesn't see that, then she doesn't deserve you. She doesn't deserve you.
Okay. Oh, don't stop. I want to watch you work. It's all about the little unseen details. But then, sometimes you just gotta sit back so you can see it all come together. You're so beautiful. I can't stop myself from falling in love with you. You okay? I'm better than okay.
How we doing, ladies? Come talk to me. Come on, uh, we can make a baby, huh? Oh hey, why don't you get rid of the redhead? We can talk, all right? All right, dude, that's enough. Back off. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hey, what you need is a dick. Nah. Fucking dykes. That's my friend, Logan. Oh, hey, nice to meet you. Well, a few of us are going to dinner. Would you like to join us? Um, uh, Ethan has Emily this weekend, so it would, uh, it would just be me. Perfect. Join us. OK. Yeah. Hey, uh, I'm going to go. Go? Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm not feeling so good. Stay. No, 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 I want you to stay. No, it's okay. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go home. Yeah. Okay, I'll s see you later. Or? Yeah. Okay. Let me in, I know you're in there. Can I come in?
I'm an asshole. I'm sorry. Talk to me. Ethan was there. Your parents there, their teachers there. I, I, I just, I wasn't ready to step into that kind of role today. What role? It's not a role. It's just us. I know, Logan, but it, it is kind of a role, okay? And it's not just us. I wish it were that simple, but it's not. I don't know, I just, sometimes I, I, I wonder if I'm up for it. For what? For being with a woman. I mean, bringing a new guy around today would have been hard enough. But to look at everybody and say, hey, I'm a big fat lesbian now, I mean, I just, I... Wow. I hadn't thought it through, okay. I didn't expect you to do any of that. I just prefer to be treated like I exist. You don't even do that to a friend. How do you do it? How do I do what? Love people. I don't let anyone's opinions affect how I feel. Look. I understand. This is a lot of change for you. It's not easy. I get it, but... But I hurt you. <sighs> and the last thing in the world I want to do is hurt you. Forgive me. I do. No. Really, forgive me. Sure, I, I'm, I can go. You stay with Emily. Oh, she's sound asleep. It'll only take a minute. Okay. You okay with that? Yeah. Okay. okay. Love you back.
you play <laughs> mm, being away with you you know you could come on tour with me <laughs> what mm-hmm it could be fun travel around the country together stay in these cute little hotel rooms you could bring Emily find time to paint Mm-hmm. Sounds amazing. Mm. Come on. Can you just like pretend to like the idea for a second? Oh, come. On. I love the idea. This is just not practical. I just can't quit my job. Right. Your job, of course. Yeah, my job. I love my job. And, you know, I love structure. Yes, I know. I have seen your color-coordinated sock drawer. I love my sock drawer. <laughs> <laughs> it does sound amazing, though. You know, I, uh, I never asked anyone to come on tour with me before. I'm sorry, what did you say? I said I love you. One more time. I said I love you. <laughs> <laughs> I love you too. So much. Okay, everybody, find a partner. I hate these things. Maybe you should stop organizing them. Next, we're gonna be asked to throw ourselves at each other. Um, some of your own size is good? You do. Sugar right. bridges. So just take a moment, be with your partner, take them in. Remember, trust is a really important part of every workplace relationship. So you're gonna tell me who's making you glow? You have a way of saying things, so. Well, I know there's sex glow when I see it. Sex glow. Okay, so <clears throat> partner A, turn away from partner B. Take one big step away. You know, catching me was the entire purpose of that exercise. I know, but you gotta prepare old woman before you drop something big off in her lap. You asked, and you're not old. Thank you. <laughs> I 
This is why you've been so secretive. Because I'm sleeping with a woman. <sighs> yeah, it's just not something I ever saw myself doing. just so much stuff that goes along with that, you know? Like now I, now I suddenly have a label. Black, white, straight, gay, there's nothing wrong with being gay. I know that, but you know, a lot of other people don't. Girl, this is New York. Yeah, call my parents, they live in Brooklyn. Besides, I'm not gay, I still, I still like men. I do, I'm just, I don't know. Uh, Once upon a time, what feels like a lifetime ago, I was in love with a white man. And he loved me. I wanted to spend my every waking hour with him, to spend my life with him. But back then, where I was at, it would have taken courage I didn't have support from family, friends, peers, to walk down the street hand in hand without having insults hurled at us. So what happened? I closed my heart to him, to that entire part of my life. I don't regret where I'm at, my, my family, my choices for any second, but that is one regret that still hangs over me. And living with regret is only my doing. I feel like when I close my eyes, I keep thinking that if the world didn't care, I wouldn't care. the world didn't care, I wouldn't care. Life is a series of choices, Amber. Every second we choose our happiness or our bitter remorse. And we can only love what we love and stand by that choice. Times are changing, baby. Times are changing. So, step into your life before it passes you by. Ow. Well, Logan, we're just so happy that Amber has found a friend like you during such a difficult time in her life. And we really appreciate you being here for her. It's my absolute pleasure. She's wonderful. Nice to finally meet you. Nice to put a pretty face to someone we've heard so much about. Thank you. It's great to meet you both. I actually have to get going. I have a client to meet. I'm sorry. But please enjoy the rest of your day. Okay. Um, I have to go to the restroom, so I'll just watch that anyways. Because you don't know them. <laughs> no. I like them. Mm. I love you. Mm. Mm. What is this? <sighs> it's nothing. You were leaving. Yep, I'm leaving. Logan? Oh, Logan, hey. Logan, stop! I'm sorry. You're always sorry, Amber. Hey, look, I didn't expect you to waltz into the cafe and just announce your love for me. But when are you going to be able to stand tall next to me? I told you I just need time. I How much time, Amber? 
I have never leapt like this before in my life and I keep leaping into you and I keep falling on my fucking face. I never asked you to do that. You just did it on your own. You jumped before I was ready. I don't know how this is my fault. Your fault? Are you even listening? Is everything all right? Oh, God. Mom, everything is fine. Yeah, everything's fine. Fuck! Amber, shut up, Mom. What just happened? I said I love you. Mm -hmm. I too. I got a couple of minutes, so what did you want to talk about? Hi, sweetie. Hey. Hi. What are you guys doing here? Well, Ethan called and uh, thought it was best that we uh, sit down and try to figure this thing out. What's going on? Well, we thought it best to convene. Convene? Yeah. Why? So. You and Logan. <sighs> Are you kidding me? Uh, okay, honey, that's that's not why we're here. That's wow. Why we're here. Never. They, they didn't say anything. You did. Right now. Really, Amber? What? Just explains a lot. Okay, I am not having this conversation. Okay, okay, come on, hold on, whoa, 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 come on, come on. Ethan, can we try to focus, please? Yes. Yeah, yeah, okay. I'll cut to the chase, sit down. Great, don't sit down. I got a job offer out of state, I'm leaving in three weeks. What? You're leaving? Yep. It's a two-year commitment minimum. What about Emily? I took the job, Amber. I'm not asking for your fucking Ethan, permission. Relax. Just talk to her what? like talk that. Talk to her like that. Okay. What? what? You just can't stay do that. focused on hey. Emily hey, here. Hey, you have no so about idea. Emily here. All right? Enough! Enough! Stop it! <sighs> enough. Mom, Dad, I... Can we just... <sighs> You're right. You know, we'll be in the car. I think that went well.
You know I really did love you, Ethan. Part of that never goes away. I know that you think that I pushed you away. A long time ago, I, I, I pushed you away, but... You, you didn't push me away, Amber. You burned my life to the ground. I know, mine too. And I'm sorry about that. It's just that... I still love you. And I don't know how to do this. I'm sorry that you're hurting. Look, I, I know I was an asshole to you, a lot. I regret that. No, look at me, Amber. Tell me what to do. <laughs> you tell me what to do and I'll do it. I was a kid, Ethan. We were just kids. I, 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 you need to be able to see that. I mean, can you see that? Yeah. I didn't like the person I was becoming around you. I hated her, and I don't want to be her anymore. I think that we both failed us. And Emily. But Emily can't live without you. You're an amazing mother. Yeah. But you're her father. And she's gonna miss you so much. Why do you have to? He's leaving in three weeks. Wow, just like that. Yep. It's just a lot of changes coming my way. I can help with Emily. I can help you. But I gotta figure everything out with work and just everything's gonna be really different. Amber. Amber, I don't think that you're listening to me. Hey. I'm saying that I wanna be a part of your life and Emily's life in a bigger way. I know, and that's very sweet. But you're leaving for tour and not forever. Okay. I'm here. I know. I know, out. but it doesn't matter because it's not the right time. <sighs> You're awfully quiet tonight. <sighs> yeah, I guess. Anything you want to talk about? 
There's just a lot going on right now. You know, with you taking Emily on and a lot of, a lot of things. Yeah. I know it's gonna be a lot with work, but I'm actually really excited. I miss her so much. Hey. What's going on? I think we need to talk. Okay. The owners of the apartment I, I'm taking care of are coming back early. And, uh, you know I'm going on tour for a few months. And I'm not sure where my home base is gonna be when I come back to New York. Okay. That's all. I just... What? I think we need to break up. What? I'm sorry. I just don't think this is working. What? I... We just can't keep doing this. What? I... I don't understand. Look, okay, I know that I said that this isn't the right time. But I think maybe once Emily settles in a little, you know, you can, you can move in with us, with me. Move in? Yes, I, I think that I'm ready for that. I'm... I mean it, Logan, I am ready for that. That's what it... You know, if this is about my parents, you know, I don't, I don't care what they think. Emily loves you. She loves you. I love you. I love you. And I know that I keep letting you down, but I never loved anybody like I love you. So why are you doing this? Because, Amber, I can't love you from such a vulnerable place. You say yes to me, and my life is amazing. You say no, and I'm crushed, and I can't love you from this place. I, I really, I really... I need you, okay? I need you. I don't, I don't want to do this alone. I don't. You have all these things that you want to do, you know? And there's so much you have to focus on. And it's not me. You gotta figure out what you want. I know what I want. I know what I want. I want you. Please don't do this. Don't do this, okay? Please don't do this. I'm sorry. So this is it then? That's all? I need you to go. Can I walk you home? <laughs> At least. No. You should just go. Can, I can still walk Please you go. home. Please go.
go. Please just go. Nothing lasts forever like a broken heart. No amount of time can get you off my mind. You change the way I see myself. There's no leaving you behind Deeply you have Nothing lasts forever Like a broken heart I'm standing in You look like you're okay Sounds good on my end. I'm not sure what you want me to do with this information, Amber. I don't think that lifestyle suits you or Emily. It's for the best. You don't think it suits me, Mom? It's not a dress that we're talking about. You asked my opinion. No, I didn't, Mom. You asked me how I was doing, and I can't hide this. I'm sorry, I'm a mess. Exactly why you need to turn the page. Nothing good can ever come of this, darling. Why not? Because it's not who we are, Amber. I'm your daughter, Mom. I'm not you. Of course not, but you're so but what? I love her. Emily loves her. And she left you. It's for the best. Yeah, maybe it is for you, Mom, but it's not for me. She made me happy. She made me feel alive for the first time. And, and she loves me. I know that she still loves me. It's not love. It'll pass. It'll pass? Mom, this is a heartache, okay? This is good old-fashioned heartache. And if you can't see that, 
You can't see past your shame that I'm sorry, but you don't get to be a part of this. You don't get to be a part of my life. You're gonna lose me. You're gonna lose her. You will lose us. Come on, I'm going, come on. Grace, you just need to let her be, okay? She'll ruin her reputation. This isn't easy for me either. Not in the same way as you, but mostly because it's not easy for Amber. I mean, I can see that. She could just wait to meet the right man. She was happy. I mean, yeah, you stopped to notice that? Happy? Well, put yourself in her shoes for a second. I would never be in her shoes, Michael. Maybe being with Logan surprised her. Maybe it was there all along. In any case, she's 30 years old, going through a divorce and coming out to the world. As gay. I'm not, look, maybe, maybe she is. Uh, there's nothing we can do to change that. I'm not sure I'd want to. But you're on your own then. Grace, don't do this. She's still your daughter. She's still the same Amber. This is not something that you'll buckle under to please you. Don't push her away. Well, should we get some lunch? You know what restaurant's really close by? Yeah. You okay? Mm hmm Really? Because it seems like maybe you're upset about something. Hey there, little girl. Why so glum? I don't know. Maybe we should do some silly rock puns to make her laugh. No, 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 no. She hates silly rock puns. Well, my sediments, exactly. I was magma before it was cool. That's stupid. You're stupid. Hey, 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 hey. Whoa. First of all, that's not okay. Okay? What's going on? I don't know. What are you upset about? I don't know. You know what the feelings are, maybe? I don't know. I said I don't know. Okay. Look, I know it's been a big year. A lot of changes. A lot of feelings, big feelings, confusing feelings. And I, I, I it's hard for a grown up, you know? I, I'm, I'm feeling, feeling confused too. Really? Yeah. But you need to know that when you're feeling this, when you're feeling confused and angry, you can tell me. There's nothing you can say that's gonna hurt my feelings. Really? Yeah, really. I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. I feel so angry. Ugh. Everything's messed up. That's a good plot. Should I get some pizza? So water cure.
it's mine, but honey, I think it's time to put it away. Your mom will be here soon. Do we have to? I'm oh, sorry, love. Come on. Can we play again tomorrow? Yes. How about next week? Mm-hmm. Next year? Yeah. What about when I'm big like mommy? Of course. I will always be there for you. for coming, Phil. Of course. The best. See you later. Hey, um, uh, tell Sol I say hi, by the way. Okay. Are you familiar with her work? Uh, yeah. <laughs> what do you think? Part of me loves it, and the other part of me is terrified about what everybody else is thinking. You're the artist. <laughs> well, now it would seem insincere of me to say that I think your work is exquisite. Maybe a little. It is. Thank you. Well, I, I won't take up any more of your time. Uh, yeah, okay. It's nice to meet you. Uh, Tim. Tim. I'm Amber. Amber, um, do you drink coffee? Just because if you do, I could sit next to you while you do that. Would it be okay if I called you sometime? Yeah, sure. There's my contact information's at the front desk. Okay, okay, <laughs> well then, I'm gonna go to the front desk. Congratulations. Thank you. Enjoy your night. Thanks. Excuse me. Hi. Uh, Amber? Yes. Regina Day. Yes. Yes, I know who you are. <laughs> it's such a treat to meet you. I'm just so honored that you would come to my opening. I want to talk to you about your work. I do. I have a few ideas. That would be great. <laughs> Thank you. Yes. Well, you have guests to entertain. <laughs> yes, of course. <laughs> Do call me. You can count on it. Thank you. Hi. Amber? Yes. We got Logan here to hear performing live at the Caveat downtown Toronto. Remember Could you turn that up, the please? Logan, it is such a treat to have you in the studio. Thank you so much for having me. I'm so happy to be here. Of course. Your new single, Hold On, is just climbing the charts. Can you tell us a little bit about what inspired that song? Gosh, um, I don't know where to start. <laughs> Come on, girl. You could dig in there a little bit more. You know, we're live. So you want me to spill my guts for the world? <laughs> <laughs> well, for you, JoJo, <laughs> I will. Um... Well, you know, it's simple. It's about love. <laughs> you know, the kind of love you dream about when you're a kid, when you're growing up and learning about everything. And then you get older and you stop believing in it. <laughs> but uh, turns out it's real. It's a thing. Do tell. It's uh, in the past. Long story. All right, they all. Okay. Um, 
Well, when I first wrote the song, it was kind of like I wrote it for someone I hadn't even met yet. But um, when I, I played it for an audience for the first time, a friend of mine was in the room and all of a sudden it was really clear that somehow I had written it for her. Uh, that's the story. <laughs> that's it. You heard it here oh first on JB Live Toronto. Now what you have all been waiting for. This is Logan Pierce with Hold On. I know that you're coming I can see down the road I'm traveling But I'm not alone So when do you leave? Should I go? I mean, what if she was talking about someone else? I Okay, fine, but what if it doesn't mean what I think that it means? Tell me this. When you're an old woman, will you be okay and look back on your life not knowing, wondering what would have happened? Your time is now. Step in. Don't hang back by the sidelines. I love you. Well, wouldn't that be a surprising turn of events? Mm -hmm. Yeah, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Okay, go. Go get your woman. Uh, Don't you have a flight to catch? Yes, okay, yes, thank you. Thank you. I love you. I love you. I love you. Pour another coffee in my cup. Give me something pretty to look at. I need every distraction I can get. It would be so easy to slip up. show tonight. Thank you. Yeah, there's someone here to see you.
You are incredible. You, um, I uh, don't know what to say. I feel like if I speak too loud or uh, move too fast, you might just disappear. I'm not going anywhere. I heard about your art show. Congratulations. Thank you. So, did you just come for the music or? I miss you. needed to see myself before I could see myself in the world with you. I was looking for approval from everyone, but what I really needed was my own, and I know that now. And I know that my life just isn't right without
words have flown away and left us here just staring. Hi, I'm looking in your eyes and suddenly. 